Okay, back with Larry out here. Um, it's farm out by Highmore, South Dakota. And what we're looking at here, Larry, is your spring wheat? Yes, this is spring wheat. Okay, it's looking really good. Yep, it's got a good uh, control of disease and that's really good. And uh, we're right on time, really, July 12th. Yep, pretty it's close. It's just starting to turn a little bit. Just a little bit. All right, and you got F14 on yep. this? We put one gallon of F14 on with our first pass of weed spray. And then we come in a flag leaf and sprayed uh, C 16 ounces of C4. And then we come in uh, right after uh, it flowered, and I put another pass of 16 ounces of C4 on. All right. Well, what we've been seeing so far is some pretty good protein and uh, and test weight. So hopefully that's what you got here. We'll find out when the combine comes through. Combine will tell the story. Okay. And then over here, right across in this field, you got your soybeans. Yep. The soybeans are a little later than last year. Well, the thing about the soybeans is it's been a terrible year to try to get anything in, right? Right. It was really, really, it's still really wet up here. Highly unusual. But these beans are probably farther ahead than a lot of beans that I've seen. They've started, uh, we've had some heat the last few days and they've started coming on and uh, I think they're, we just got done spraying them here today. For weeds, and we put one gallon of F14 on them. That's put the a gallon one. of F14 on? That's what All we right. did. So you'll be seeing a giant fall out of the sky, or Jack trying to climb these yeah, here in a couple of days. That's what I'm looking for. All right. Well, looking good, Larry. Let's go over and check out your uh, cornfield. Okay.